Pac-12 Gymnastics Meet of the Week presented by Pacific Premier Bank. Rich Burke along with Elisa Mao here in Corvallis. California Golden Bears with a comfortable win, although Oregon State posted their best score so far this year. Maya Bordas for Cal did the all-around, and she had a 9-9-2-5 on bars. Yeah, ties for the win on bars with Kiana George. She has beautiful lines and one of the highest Jaegers you will see in college gymnastics. Does that in connection down to the low bar. Exquisite form and amplitude throughout this routine. She'll do a blindfold into her double tuck, finds the landing and the event title. And then on balance beam, she caught it in 9-9. Nine, nine. She's so clean. Love how she moves down the length of the beam, combining dance and acrobatic moves. There's her acrobatic series there. So smooth, really polished throughout this beam routine. Tumbles into the gainer fold, just hopping around a little bit, but the 9-9, great job. Christina Peterson did the all around for Oregon State. And on balance beam, she had a 9-9-2-5. Eyes for the win. Watch how she tumbles the length of the beam. Two back handsprings into the layout. Career high for her. And the, only the seventh time she was has been in the Oregon State lineup. A super job for the competitor without a ton of experience on the pressure-packed beam. Remarkable. Christina Peterson. Yeah, the fist pump. Way to go, Christina. But this meet belonged to Kiana George, who matched her career high on the all-around at 39.65, and it started off with a 9.925 on vault. Near flawless on this year, Chenka Fall again out of a 9.95, so she was close to perfect on the vault. On balance beam, another 9.925. Wins the beam again today. And that difficult series there, the front aerial into the back tuck, and then this double wolf turn, not quite as difficult as the triple wolf turn, named the George. Yes, named after her. And so Kiana George, that 9925 on beam, and she followed up with a 9-9 on floor. Really difficult tumbling with the front double full into the tuck, and then puts on a dance party for her teammates, bringing the energy in the third rotation for Cal. Well, Kyle has the reigning Pac-12 Gymnast of the Week with Nevea D'Souza, who carded a 39-6 in the all-around last week, and Kiana George does her a little better, a 39-6-5. Yeah, Ties her all-around all, uh, all career high. Fifth highest score in the country tonight, that all-around performance by Kiana George. And a solid performance for Christina Peterson of Oregon State as well. Cal gets the win over Oregon State. Kyle will next take on Utah at Utah, Friday, 6 o'clock Pacific, 7 o'clock Mountain on Pac-12 Network.